Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy to be back another week with another video and I thought for today's video, I would do a little fall favorites, my favorite products when it comes to beauty, fashion, makeup, and all that that I've been loving. Start with fashion because I love fashion and this Pauline bag, I'm gonna do a little bit of a close up, has been my go-to bag every single day and every single night. It's like the perfect size where you can wear it at night and you can wear it in the day and it's just like it's perfect it's not too big it's not too small it literally fits so many things like it fits everything it's crazy it's huge and i've been loving it i love the quality i think the price point is also fair if you consider the quality is really amazing brand and the quality and the attention to details is so incredible and I've been loving this. It matches everything. A color like this, you can't go wrong with it. During fall, during winter, during the summertime. And I love it. It's so nice and so easy. So this has definitely been a favorite this season. And I think it's going to be next season as well. I'm never going to stop wearing this. One thing about me is I don't care to repeat an outfit. I'm going to repeat an outfit. I'm going to repeat my bags thousands of times in my shoes. I'm an outfit repeater. I love it. If I know something works, I'm gonna wear it again and again and again. Next one is a little controversial because a lot of the comments told me to return these boots. It's these Jeffrey Campbell boots. They're cowboy boots, but heeled. And I love like a stiletto heel. I think there's nothing sexier than a stiletto heel. And the cowboy boot style is very me. I love it. I wear this with like an oversized sweater and shorts to dinner or like a mini dress. Or even I wore it with like wide leg jeans and all you could see is like the pointy toe and the heel, which I really love. I feel like this color and the suede fabric is giving fall vibes and... They've definitely been a favorite of mine. I love them. Again, I've worn them a lot and I think I'm gonna wear them tonight as well, cause why not? Another favorite is the Stanley Cup. I used to have the big size, you know, the ginormous one that's like all over TikTok. And I wouldn't be drinking enough water. It would just be too big for me. And it wasn't realistic for me to drink like two of them a day. I just wouldn't get down to it because they were so heavy. I wouldn't want to carry them around. So dehydrated, I'm not silly, but like I switched to this. I think this is the 20 ounce. The other one was so heavy. I had to like bring it with me at the gym. It was like an extra weight, but this is easy. It's lightweight. It's very light to carry and the color is very cute. And a cute cup is going to make me want to drink more water. I don't know why. Also straw. I know straws are not great for you, but I love a straw. Next favorite is this deodorant. Why is it not focusing? It is this deodorant. This is the Donna Karen Cashmere Mist deodorant and I've had this for ages and I still have so much left. It is so good. I got this from Sephora. It actually works. A lot of deodorants don't work on me. Like it has to be a really, really good one in order to work on me. And this does. You will never smell bad using this. And I love the way it smells. It's not the classic deodorant scents that you usually get. This is Cashmere Mist and it smells like a perfume it is so good i wear this every single day and i really like it as you can tell this is definitely a favorite i've fully emptied it actually one thing about me is even if i don't like a product i will still finish the whole thing because i don't like to be wasteful so but this has been a favorite i finished it but i will repurchase it's the way leave-in conditioner it is so good i almost never brush my hair unless i spray the spray on it it just helps your hair detangle and be super silky soft, especially before you go to bed. I spray this on my hair and my hair is super soft the next day. I've gone through like three or four of this exact product because it is so good and it does smell amazing as well. They actually make perfumes as well, so they know how to make a product smell amazing. This is incredible. I do suggest you try it. Another fit. Oh my god, this is leaking. But another favorite is the Sosia body oil. Does it focus? I'm not sure. As you can tell, again, I'm almost out of this. This is amazing for after you shower. While you're still in the shower, your body's still damp. If you want to apply this body oil everywhere, then pat your body with your towel like you normally would. Your skin is going to feel so soft. The family Malibu that makes these products, they're really good. 
all clean. This doesn't make my body feel greasy at all. I hate greasy oils and I think applying them when you're still fresh off the shower, damn, your body's just gonna absorb it a lot faster and you're not gonna have that greasy effect that I hate. And then you wear clothes and you feel greasy and you're, it's like the worst feeling ever. This definitely doesn't do that. But it's cruelty-free, vegan, gluten-free, non-GMO, I don't know. It smells very natural. I do not know how else to describe this, but I like it. I have to mention my collab with Every Jewels. Let me focus. This is the necklace I created with them and I love it. It is so me. We've been designing this since February. It is all my favorite charms. It's like a good luck charm and who can use a little extra luck in their lives? I just love it. It's such a cute gift to give to someone. The little horseshoe, the little evil eye. Very Greek, very me. And it says lucky as well with a little rhinestone. And I absolutely love it. Obsessed with how this turned out. And it's been my go-to lately. I can finally start wearing it because I've had different versions of this for so long. I couldn't even wear it. But now I can. And I love it. I say a big thank you to you girls who supported me and bought the necklace and I can't wait to see you wear it and style it Some photos and they get me so excited so thank you again for supporting me no amount of thank yous will ever be enough truly yeah it has been a big favorite this fall moving on to a scent I am a big scent girly I love smelling good I like my house smelling good I want to smell good at all times loving the born dreamer charlie d'amelio perfume if you want something really light if if you're going to work every day and you don't want to smell something really intense and you also want to go to the gym and you want to smell really good you want something that smells good but nothing overpowering you don't want like a baccarat rouge nothing that like when you walk in a room it's like so overpowering so good i, I don't know what charlie added in this but whatever she did it smells amazing it's very vanilla -y, very light and floral but also musky and sexy i can't describe it but it's been my go-to scent to wear like on an everyday basis when i want to wear something that just smells good nothing overpowering when i'm running my errands going to the gym or even in the house i gotta smell good even when i'm chilling in the house i like to wear perfume and this is perfect because it's not overpowering yet it does a really good job of making you smell good so this has definitely been a favorite i gravitate towards this every single day perfume trays I've been going for this lately, so I have to give it a shout out. Makeup favorite. I have been very into my glow lately. I've been in my glow era for sure. And it's all because of this product. It's this Laura Mercier liquid highlighter. I have the champagne pink. I also have some other shades. Yes, I have the peach bronze and the gold glow. They give you this amazing glow without making your makeup look chalky. Like sometimes when you wear highlighters and it's a powder highlighter, your makeup looks chalky and it doesn't look like you're glowing from within. These highlighters truly make you look like you're glowing from within. They give you this amazing glow, which I love. I'm all about my glow. I just think it looks healthy and young and fun. And it's with the help of these liquid highlighters. I think they're underrated. I haven't seen a lot of people talk about them. So do not sleep on these. I would get gold glow. If I could only get one, I would definitely get gold glow. It's what I'm wearing right now. I wish I could put this all over my face. Love it so much. to be extra with your glow. Try the Tatcha Mist. This mist is going to give you the most incredible glow ever. It's one of those hero products for me. I finished two of these before and I'll never stop using this. It just makes you look healthy and plump and gorgeous. You can wear this with makeup, without makeup. I actually like to set my makeup with this, but you can definitely just wear this on its own. I've also done that loads of times and I really, really like it. Next we have this book, Journey of the Heart. Heart, I saw Liv post this on her Instagram stories and I was like, what is this book? I immediately purchased it because it was right up my alley. It's small little paragraphs of, of inspiring words for every single day. So every day I like to read today's page and it's just so inspiring and it makes me feel good. It takes like literally less than a minute to read it, but it does change the way you're feeling. It just makes you so happy and it's very inspirational and I love it. I forward to waking up, making my coffee and reading Journey of the Heart every single day. It's definitely favorite of every season, but I thought I'd mention it. Last favorite is this moisturizer. My skin has been very dry lately. It's usually more on the oily side, but it has been dry. 
This is the pharmacy cream. It's the honey halo. I know it's been around for a while. I actually like the magnetic spatula so you never lose it. I feel like with these spatulas you always lose them. But this moisturizer is so thick and perfect and it smells really good and it moisturizes you and it keeps you moisturized the whole day. It smells like honey and it's great. I highly suggest, especially now with the cold coming and winter, if you're looking for a really good moisturizer that will keep you moisturized all day and it's thick and luxurious and it does the job, try this and you're gonna thank me later. Like these are all of my fall favorites. I'm sure I'm forgetting some, but maybe I'll do a part two. Let me know what else you'd like to see from me because I'll definitely be recording it and I hope you have an amazing day.